And welcome back everybody. Temperatures are sitting into the low 80s out there at the moment. It's 82 degrees, beautiful, bright and sunny with a few clouds off towards the horizon. Now right there's a live look Interstate 59 from South Central Regional Medical Center. A lot more sunshine out in Waynesboro where they're sitting at 80 degrees at the moment. Not much happening out there for today. And Center Point Electric Grade are very quiet except for this one tiny shower which has popped up. It's, it's been going down Old uh, Oak Grove Road and now it's right on top of USM at the moment. So if you're at yeah, USM, it's right on top of campus, but it's only going to last for about another minute or so. This is moving off towards the east, so a brief shower heading towards Petal, but don't expect a lot. This is only going to stick around for maybe a, probably another 20 or 30 minutes at best, but there's really not much support with this system. All the organized stuff today is up in the northern uh, Mississippi, Alabama, and into Tennessee with their under a severe thunderstorm watch. But outside of that one little shower, we're not anticipating a lot tonight. In fact, most Mostly clear skies as we head into the evening. Temperatures are going to fall from the 70s back down into the low 70s. And tomorrow when you wake up, we're going to start off your day with temperatures down into the low 60s. Another beautiful day tomorrow. Bright and sunny. High stopping out at 87 degrees. A quick warm up into the afternoon and get ready. It's going to be a beautiful day. So tomorrow looks amazing. Highs into the mid to upper uh, 80s all across the area. A little bit warmer. You're also going to feel that humidity as that ground continues to dry out from the two to four inches of rain that was dumped across South Mississippi yesterday alone, but it still will be beautiful as we go into tomorrow. Humidity will stay on the lower side, but we'll really start to feel things uh, become sticky as we go in towards the end of the week, but that makes sense because we got a storm system that'll be moving through as we head towards Friday, and there the rain chance is increasing all the way up to an 80% chance of rain on Friday afternoon. Saturday, a few showers lingering maybe in the morning, but then we dry out, and then Sunday looks much nicer, but we're going to have to watch Friday system carefully. There's the potential for several things. One, the possibility of a few strong to possibly severe thunderstorms. We're already under a level two threat for all of South Mississippi and a good chunk of central Louisiana. These storms are going to move in early Friday morning. We'll have to watch them for the potential for damaging winds and uh, we'll watch everything very carefully. Still a few days out. There are some uncertainties in the forecast. That system moves off towards the east and Saturday will begin to dry out and we're going to need a chance to dry out because look at this. Another two to three inches of rainfall is expected in our area alone as we go towards Friday. So it looks to be another very wet storm system moving through the area. Beyond that, temperatures begin to warm up into the low 90s as we go into next week. So get ready after this weekend storm on Friday, we dry things out and then we crank up the thermostat back into the 90s. We go on Monday and Tuesday, but of course we're going to watch Friday carefully. We'll keep you updated as we get a little closer towards then. All right, Patrick.